Hello folks. I'm out and about again today. Just a little off trail from over at the Farmington Trail over St. Joe Park. And I thought I'd do a little cruising through here on this beautiful sunshiny day. It is nice today. Wind blowing good and strong though. They say they're having gonna have gas up to 50 mile an hour. I can hear it in the trees now. It's, it's not 50 now, but mainly it's going to be 10, 10 to 20, I think, it, and then uh, with big gusts up to 50. Almost like Wyoming. I thought I'd get out of here today, and uh, it's just such a beautiful day. Get out and play in the woods again. We'll meander around over here for a little while and get, get up this bank. Oh, here we go. Things are starting to turn a little green. Greener, I should say. Get me a pointing stick here. Let me see. This one right here might do. Oh, excuse me if I turn you on your head. Break some of this little Jag your stuff off of it. Okay. One of the things I want to point to is this rabbit motel here. Even got this at the back door. Right there. Here's the front door. <laughs> See some nuts in there. Imagine squirrels are had some stuff buried in there over the, over the winter. Well, partially shell nuts. What it is? They get the shells are there. They've been in there. Hopefully that wind won't, <coughs> wind won't get too loud for you. Oh, leaves a little dry. You can probably hear them crunching between, between my toes, beneath my feet. That's all right. <coughs> Like a little bit of an old water run down through here. Looks like a piece of barbed wire or something. Must be a no <coughs> fence line or looks pretty old right there. <clears throat> I've been over in this section before, it's nice. I'm 
get my legs all stretched up. Got some shorts on today and these little small growth is stretching on my legs a little bit. Water run down this way. I need a stream well, over here. You probably see it. Uh, if you can or not, but let me zoom a little bit and see if you can. Just right, get my finger up here, right in there. Just wind around that way. I hope you're going to enjoy going on these trips with me. Hope it encourages you to get out away from the TV and enjoy times like this. There's an old bike trail with a Folks have been out with their bikes. It's not really a, on the map as far as the uh, park goes, but people have gotten off trail and made their own over here with the bikes and the horses and the hiking and stuff like that. They have a, up there where we see the light brown there, that's a paved uh, bicycle and hiking trail there. It's big enough for a golf cart or so and we go around the park 16 miles I think someone told me it's, it's uh, a lot of bikers use it and hikers too but I just met some ladies up there <clears throat> when I was coming down this way they must have been having their lunch break they get out and I think they worked at the hospital or another one of the nursing homes they had their uniforms on These are hills come down and go back up to the two here that we get up to a trailhead and it's pretty good climbing. Yeah, the water ran down through there for sure. <laughs> Try not to still practicing not moving my head too quick. Yeah, let's see what we got over here. Oh, we need a bitty stream. <sighs> yeah, I think I got my camera just about right. Oop. Oh, wait here a little bit. Oh, yeah, a little side stream. Here's the, kind of the main one, if you want to call it that. It was off to the right of me there, and this little side stream here runs into it, feeds it. Yeah, it's running fairly good down through here. Yeah, looks like that might be some deer tracks right here. Yeah, coming down getting some water, I suppose. Yeah. Looks just over here, the water's been up and gushing down through there. Yeah, let's get
it across right here. Get on the other side. Water's not very deep right here. It's ran all the way up through here though from right there. It's ran up to you know, three weeks from the, or three weeks, three, about three feet from the edge of the stream right there up on the bank. Getting a bit tongue tied today. Guess I'm too excited about this nice weather. I can handle a whole bunch of this humidity down too, which is another favorite thing I like. Me and humidity don't get along too well. Whoop. Get myself in the jungle here. Yeah, you can see over across the bank how it's washed up on that curve. Left in there pretty good. I haven't had any problems through here with ticks like I did over in the main part with that uh, one big 10 mile loop. Excuse me. Yeah, get over here a little ways. That old tree got the roots in the water. Pretty good size roots too right there anyway. And then roots chase the chase the water. It's just gonna tell how old these trees are. And no minners. That's about a foot and a half little spot right there. Deep that is. Here's some moss. Let's see if I, oh, I made it without stepping in too deep. Use that moss, you really gotta watch it. This stuff is slick as oil. Especially when it's on a rock. Make sure we're looking at the same thing here. Yeah, pretty much. head down just a little bit. Keep the sun out of your eyes as much as possible. There's a, I'd say that's at least a couple of feet. Pool right in there and over there. Can you see it? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, you can. All through there. There's that uh, layer of rock on top of another one right there. Well, I tell you, a person come over here and uh, it's really hot outside and just wade in or sit in that water right there and keep cool off. But I ain't going to do it today. I don't remember what the temperature is now. I can sure tell humidity is not up there. <coughs> Hope I didn't jerk nothing leaf up there. 